Yo, this is Christian. Uh, today I want to talk about uh, working remote from a foreign country. Um, and the reason why I'm talking about this is because I just uh, had a call with someone and uh, this guy was an American living in Vietnam and he was asking me what are the chances of him being able to get a job working for an American company if he's living in Vietnam. So let's uh, let's talk about this for a bit. Uh, most of, actually no, all of, all my clients that worked with me got a remote job. Even though I don't recommend it, I don't believe your first job should be a remote job because um, I guess um, sitting next to a developer, it's it's a very rewarding uh, thing to have, and that's why I'm saying working with me is the best thing because I'm a real developer. And if you talk to me, you will become a real developer as well. Not, not if you go to a bootcamp and you are being taught by people that never worked as developers, all right? So being, um, having an in-person job, it's actually really, really beneficial for you. But because of Corona, nothing is in-person. Everything is remote. So I guess everyone loves that. But if I could give you a suggestion, I would say try to get an in-person uh, job. Well, let's talk about this guy's situation, right? So he's living in Vietnam, he's an American, and he wants to work for an American company. Well, that's the chances of that happening are not the best, right? But they are not impossible either. So you have to understand that there is no problem that you can fix. And if you put enough work, and if you are a good developer, which I strongly advocate, um, you can make it happen, okay? But if you are watching online courses, if you're a Udemy developer or you finished a bootcamp and your skills are really, really, really down, really, really low, then the chances of that happening are not that high, okay? Well, it's still possible, right? I, I don't want to lie to you. <clears throat> but because he's an American, he can probably pull that off, all right? The time zone might be a big of an issue, a bit of an issue. Uh, I don't know what's the time difference between, I guess, New York and Vietnam, but probably there are six hours, I don't know, eight hours, something like that. Don't quote me on that, I'm not really good. So he could pull it off because he's in America, but if you are, let's say, um, German trying to work for an US company, that would be pretty difficult, especially if you don't have any experience, if you are um, not a skilled professional, okay? So to summarize this whole video it's possible it would be pretty difficult but it's possible okay it also depends on what you want to do if you are looking for guarantees and stuff like that you'll never get um life doesn't work with guarantees from what i know there is no guarantee that you'll succeed there is no guarantee that um you'll become a developer there is no guarantee that uh people will live on on mars there is no guarantee about that. Life doesn't work like that. But what I can guarantee is that if you keep doing what you're doing, you'll keep getting what you're getting. So if you're not trying to get out of your comfort zone, for example, to apply for a free consultation call to, to see if we can work together if I can, and see if I can help you, you'll keep getting the same thing, which is being stuck in a loop for months and months and months and months on end, doing the same thing, right? Uh, if you are finished, if you finish the bootcamp and you don't know why people don't hire you, it's most likely your uh, programming skills. And what most people do after they finish a bootcamp, they go into the rabbit hole of online courses, and then they get stuck there for another two, three years, um, if they keep at it that long. So, this was a short video. I just finished lunch, and um, I was inspired to make this video. I'm gonna go back to work. I have some. Uh, the to take care of. But I'm gonna leave you with this idea, right? Everything is possible, there's no problem you can't fix. And uh, apply for a free consultation call to see if I can help you learn code and get your first web dev job as fast as possible. Don't apply if you're a tire kicker, don't apply if um, you don't believe in coaching and don't apply if you don't wanna become a really good developer, okay? because you are going to waste my time and you're going to waste your time as well. So yeah, peace out.